Danger at the beach in Orange County. Over the past three days, there have been a record number of people stung. So swimmers and surfers, beware. KCAL 9's Tina Patel is live in Huntington Beach with advice on how to stay safe in the water. Tina. Well, you know, the thing is, normally late December isn't really beach weather, but it has been warm. It's a holiday week, so there have been lots of people coming out here, and unfortunately, that's meant lots of injuries. Surfers aren't the only ones flocking to the beach this holiday weekend. So are the stingrays. Lifeguards took this video from the Huntington Beach Pier Saturday morning. All those gray dots are stingrays, potentially dangerous to swimmers and surfers. It's a flat fish that lays in the bottom, and when you step on it, it'll fling its tail up and hit you with a stinger. It's happened to at least 156 people in just the last three days. Record numbers, especially for this time of year. My buddy's dad got stung really bad and both legs, so... Yeah, it's been really bad. I yeah, don't... my brother got stung the other day, too. Yeah. There's a lot right now. Lifeguards don't know why there are more stingrays now, but they do know the low tides and warm weather have brought out more beachgoers, so they're trying to warn those who go in the water. The biggest thing is just to shuffle your feet on the sand, just to kind of stir up the sand, scare away the stingrays, and then if you do get hit, always go to lifeguard and uh, put your foot in hot water. Jacob Kress says soaking your foot in hot water does ease the pain. He would know he got stung on the toe when he was surfing. Lifeguards will be treating those who are injured at special stingray stations throughout the weekend, but some people might sit out the annual Surf City Splash on New Year's Day. Uh, it's definitely holding me back from getting in the water. Oh, yeah, I'm terrified to get in yeah. the water. I'm so terrified of stingrays. Yeah, some people just don't want to take the chance, but about 400 people are expected here for the Surf City Splash, and lifeguards say they will be working with organizers to make sure that the annual New Year's tradition is as safe as possible. We'll send it back to you.